What's up guys, we're back here with another video, and in today's video, as you can see, right here we have an aerator, or hush bubbles, it's like an air pump, like people use these when they go fishing, and they use it for, to keep their bait alive, right, and so, I didn't have any batteries around, and I was thinking, I was like, well, if I try this, will it work, so, basically, what I did I, they, they're not connected right now. I have a red wire and a black wire. A red wire and a black wire. And at the end of this wire is like a charger, like a USB charger. And what I did was I, um, I connected the red wire to black wire. I mean the red wire to red wire, black wire to black wire. And then I was just curious to see if it actually worked because, you know, it's like a charger cord or whatever. And it actually worked, surprisingly. I didn't, to be honest, I didn't think it would work. But, um, it's basically what I did, and I will show y'all again. So, sorry about that. So, I have the black wire already connected. So, I have the, the two red wires. It's kind of hard doing this one-handed. It's really hard, actually. Connect the two red wires. Hold on one second. That McDonald's cup right there is. I use that to um fill up the tank with water. I don't have a bucket or nothing inside my house. And I feel like bringing one in. Well, I'm just gonna get back to y'all when I have the red wires connected. As you can see, I have the two cords connected. I don't know if y'all can really, it's not focusing in. It's because of my phone. It's Android. But, um, have the two wire, red wires connected and two black wires connected, right? And so, I'm about to tape them up and plug it in and show y'all in the fish tank and I'll be back with y'all then. Alright, so as you can see, I got the wires taped up. Some electrical wire, well, electrical tape, and I taped up the wire so that, I, just in case, you know, just want to tape them up, just that way nothing's happened. But I'm about to plug it in and put it on the tank and show y'all what it looks like. Alright, so I'm back, and as y'all can see, the bubbler is plugged in, and it's running actually well. And what I plan on doing is, since, like, it's more powerful than when it had, um just batteries in it what i plan on doing is getting more wire and splitting it well more um air tubing and splitting it and get two new ends and just putting one at one end of the tank and one at the other end of the tank and that's pretty much it for the video and almost i actually um got have an anemone y'all probably seen the video before this i have an anemone and my clownfish is actually now hosting the anemone it's pretty cool, and I got mushroom coral. It's pretty small, and I got one turbo snail. Regular turbo snail, y'all can't see it because of the light. And then I got a Mexican turbo snail right there. It's like pretty neat, but if you haven't already, make sure to like, subscribe, turn on post notifications, and stay tuned for the next video.